Hey guys, Stina Rose here, and welcome back to another episode from the Wells Knight Patreon server. We are here in the nether at a really amazing build done by Angel of Light. Now, I am here at his place because today I have a really exciting special episode for you because I'm not alone. Angel Hello. of Light's with me. Yep. Hi, Angel. Hello. Um, and he's going to show us around this really amazing base that he's been building. So this is the nether roof. See? Bedrock. Nether roof. And coming out of the nether roof, he's built this amazing angel and reaper. I'm not sure how well the reaper is going to show for you guys, but he's got this amazing angel and reaper. And I thought that it would be fun to show you guys what's going on. So let's get to it. Hi, Angel. Hey, Zina. Oh. Well, this is not the first damage we're gonna get. No, no. But welcome to my, uh, to the first part of the area, of my PvP area, is, uh, is, uh, what is this? PvP area. Yeah. And, uh, I know you're not a PvP fan, but, uh... Nope. <laughs> but it's well, uh, well detailed with uh, a lot of terraform forming stuff, and a lot of detailing work in the island as well that we later gonna discover these ain't these two things right here are just amazing how long did it take you to put these together so the funny thing is that um, I have had like half of these built for the mo majority of the, the server because everybody only went to like the portal here okay. so um, so I've, I've had like half done of a reaper for like five months and then uh, <laughs> <laughs> around november december i built the the behind part okay <laughs> okay so i'm so, maybe i haven't seen the behind part yet then yeah you you probably haven't oh so we have the sickle now that is yeah, the, new yeah the the scythe and uh, scythe sorry <laughs> yeah my bad <laughs> Oh, well, I I'm not even under, but yeah, I I designed these hands of the of the Reaper and the Angel, like with the with the obvious like death having the bone structure, mm -hmm. right? And the Angel more like, and the, and of course like I just chose what kind of clay I had. Of course. So. Very cool, yeah. but this and, isn't uh, the coolest part of of the build, is it? No. And definitely not this very not detailed behind. So yes, um, I'm if so disappointed. This, <laughs> so disappointed. We come the, <laughs> yeah, if we come through the portal, we will um, come up on the tree crown. I think it's called right in English. The crown. Yes. Now, okay, yeah, for my for my viewers uh, who haven't met Angel before, Angel is not no. um, American or Canadian. Where are you from, Angel? I'm from a little country called Denmark. I normally don't sign like this, but uh, I have this very, very hard, like cold at the moment, really destroying my voice. Well, so, um, I hope that you get and, well soon. <laughs> I do. And, and see, the funny thing, if you follow me, Stina. Okay. So, Aletha Prime, Matthew, and I believe it was Vander, uh, decided to prank me while I was sick again um, when I was building this. So, if you come up here, Vander just did a. Uh, did a, a sick angel. <laughs> it's a self-portrait. Well, <laughs> it's not not a self-portrait because he made it, but it's. Bandit did it. But don't don't look down. That will spoil the. Okay, no no looking down. So how do I get over here without dying? If <laughs> if I'm not allowed to look down, angel, you're gonna kill me, aren't you? <laughs> no. I don't believe you. <laughs> Oh, uh, maybe we should. <laughs> so I've been, I've been, I've been tackling and having strokes joke with Stina for the last uh, few months because she haven't died a lot, and I've done plenty doing this. Yes, you have. <laughs> but, but what we are adventuring into is uh, the first part of the the PvP area where the PvP is enabled. Okay. And uh, right, right here. You can like take a peek. There is this two first out. Like you can go out and look here, and just like take a peek of the the landscape of the island. Oh, you've added you've added little islands since I was here last. 
Yes, I have. Oh, I like them. Very cool. Is it the same over Thank here? You. Yeah. And this is also, in uh, all of these are uh, tactical areas where you can, uh, like, when you're playing, you can get a, a like, a, a tactical advantage over your opponent. Okay. Like, the small details like that are hidden throughout the, the game. So playing with you, though, would not be very fair because you know all of these tactical advantages. Exactly. <laughs> and I'm not sure if I want to show you them all because two of them are, are, are deadly if you're not <laughs> And you know me. <laughs> yeah. So this is um, the ground floor of the tree. Okay. Of the PvP islands. Like, I, I was calling this the, the upper floor. Okay. Um, because I have added, I uh, have added something underneath a cave. Oh, wonderful! This thing and is if, huge. Yes, it's. Uh, it definitely took its took its time. That is amazing, and I love the details that you've put in with the the texture variations in the ground, uh, the details of the tree. I would definitely think I, I kept it well high quality, especially with all the random creepers. <laughs> especially all the random creepers. <laughs> have so. you have you taken care of the creeper problem? Sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> it happens. Okay. So keep an eye so, out. <laughs> yeah. So if you I, no, you cannot see from here. We're gonna go inside the mountain to see that. Okay. Because you're maybe gonna go die if you go that down there. <laughs> but here is um, is one of the cave. We're not gonna go down there because there, it's not a well designed area. Okay. I think not, my standard. Not your favorite. But area. okay. Not my not my favorite. But if you go here, you can see this kind of like like tree root that has this hidden, not well, kind of hidden entrance oh, which cool. leads us down to the cave oh this is beautiful this is absolutely beautiful thank you and I love the waterfall coming down yeah and uh, just I made all of this and had to work with with all of this after I made the, the island so all of this is like after I made this main structure and the tree on top, I came underneath and made this cave. You didn't do this part first? Nope. You're crazy. Um, is the chicken yeah. part of the game? So, Stina, if you follow me, <laughs> I'll, I will let you know why there's natural spawning occurs a lot. And this is why people are calling me the crazy guy. I'm like, okay, what the... Um, um, Welcome to the void. A angel? Don't fall down. It's just 200,000 black concrete. 200,000? Yeah. Okay, so guys, this is the Wells Knight server. This is survival. This is not creative. This is survival. So you had to place down that much concrete oh and i had to clear all the area first as well wow wow and um you can take a little peek because this um right here will show you if you lean a little bit my base is under here where kind of like the void has okay. an opening wow we definitely will have to go down there and take a look at that too we have to. Yes. So up here is the first, um, like, if you come from this side, there's a tree branch mm -hmm. that you can jump down. And for once, I don't have ender pearls, but you can jump down here and walk off here. Okay. And this means you get an advantage in, in this kind of area of the PvP. Okay. So stuff like that are hidden, and as well, one is over there, and the other and like there's a lot of small like hidden detailed um, hidden places and if, yeah hidden places and like cur curved areas where you can see the player from one side and not the other and stuff like that 
very cool. So what you were saying is you're getting all kinds of whoops mob yeah. <laughs> spawning in here because because you don't there have is grass. no area <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so I have like there I have no problems with food now because I <laughs> you just come like, up, up here and here. pee for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh well, talking about the, the oh. blinds, but well. So Angel doesn't completely believe in lighting up areas. Um. <laughs> Come on, Stina. <laughs> Just a little bit. See, there's even torches. Yes. Torch. Yes, you also have an arrow in your hip. <laughs> oh, well. So, yeah. <laughs> but this there's beautiful. not more to show you. Okay, so um, there's here, there's another the angel. There's another view of the angel. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Where where were we? I I got lost. Distracted by the beautiful scenery. Hello. Where'd you go? Stina. I, Stina. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Hi. Do you have an ender pearl? Uh yes, I do. Okay. What? 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 Come. Where did you go? Down. All the way down? Hey, Stina. Let's oh. take a look from underneath. Okay. That's what you... Okay. <laughs> That's what I'm... Uh, I know how to enter Pearl. Okay, here we go. Boop. And... Hey, Stina. Hi! There's a spider behind so you. So if you look... <laughs> still alive. So if you look behind me, you can get a better view of, like, the underneath. Oh, that is really cool. And yeah, there was an unfortunate area where uh, I, there, it wasn't possible for me to hide. Uh, otherwise, because a lot of the cave inside is is actually 100% spawn proof. Okay. But I meant that some had to be outside. It's the same on the other side. Okay. But I think that's a little price to give up. Mhm. Mm it is a very small price. So if we uh, develop, what's it called, like? Dove into the. <laughs> I, I do have a quick question. Now, these islands don't go yes. all the way around yet. Are you planning on finishing a circle of small islands around the? Yes, island? I, uh, I am planning um, a circle of islands because I just think that will look like amazing. Yes, it will. I, I was just and, curious on and, that. And you know what? what? You can even PVP from the islands. I made it so you can jump for some of them. <laughs> he says that like I'm actually gonna PvP. <laughs> He's oh, funny. Stina, one day. One day. One day. Maybe, maybe at the end of the season when my death <laughs> count is no longer a thing I worry about. <laughs> <laughs> so, it, this was uh, actually out, a ways up higher. Okay. Wow, I, I fell down. Okay, but I had to take it down because of the void. Right. So I'm just, I'm kind of going slow to show this very nice circular path that you've created. Yeah, th this was around 20 blocks more up in the air. That just like gives a picture of how far this mountain actually was. Okay. Basically up to the, to the one island start. So do we want to just quick at the villages or? Sure, let's, let's just go see. So this is where none of the terraforming has been taking place. This is literally just spawn proofing. Okay. Because I've taken the path of becoming a, a community guy here. So I am, if I just know a person just a little bit, they can come and trade with my villagers, uh, which I have been uh, stacking up since the start. Yes. And there are some good trades and... Uh, there is what there is, but I, I'm close to getting, like, I do it sometimes, just rolling through some. Okay. And I'm soon up to having every enchantment. Oh, that's fantastic. So, wow. a lot of people have been using uh, been using these village villagers. Mending for 10, that's really good. Yeah, and looting for 16 and stuff like that. Very nice. Yeah, it's, it's not like some hardcore, uh, uh, like, I have to get the best villager. It's just, like, slowly going through them. 
so where we are heading now is uh, we're going into where we have many good moments. <laughs> many good and, moments. And uh, <laughs> take away your bow, Stina, because you know what's coming. <laughs> I do know what's coming. Notice I pulled out my steak instead. <laughs> okay, I hope that this shows up in the the video. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot this. <laughs> this is so cool. So you, he's done the fog effect in this area, and I think it looks really neat. I don't know what it's going to show like in the video, though. <laughs> And even the little details, like you can see over here, where just one block is just a little bit inverted. Yes. And a lot of that has been like going into it, so a lot of detail will be popping up, like when you come closer, because of the fog. Yes. Angel is a detail guy. I mean, this is obviously this is just amazing, the stuff that he's coming up with. And one thing I love about Angel's builds are they they're so organic. Yeah, you you even yourself have been calling uh, me the hidden scar. Yes, yes, our he's the scar of our <laughs> our server. <laughs> and I got the nickname because I got <laughs> mycelium to work. Okay, yes, okay. So, um, you guys who've been watching my my channel know my hate for cancer grass, but somehow Angel has managed to make this work, and I. Hello! Your magic. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's also a little crazy because, um... Oh, I only got five crystals. Yeah, yeah, five crystals as decoration. Mm-hmm. And I'm the guy who's not lighting up areas. Uh-huh. Yeah. So... Yeah, that's so, fun. So this is uh, what I'm calling a uh, crystal... No, no, sorry, a bone tree. A bone tree. Um, yes, that was my idea when I was making this. It's very cool. Kind of like, um, because I was going uh, like heaven and and uh, hell okay. kind of theme, mm -hmm. which I'm going to show you the, the ones that I've actually worked on. Okay. And if we come through here, there is this giant crystal. Whoa. This, this is my my crystal. Which is also a mob farm. That must have taken a while. Um, is that not powdered concrete? That is powdered concrete. So, string? So, string. If you could see in my angel at the in, in uh, the PvP entrance, mm -hmm. that was behind the wings. There was a bone outline, but white concrete okay. in the middle. And it was the same idea. Wow. So this is kind of using the two contrast blocks as well. But yeah. So this is. Um, I was imagining this being something that was uh, like taking away slowly, like going upwards. If you look at the detail in the roof, kind of like that. Uh, I don't, again, not English, but uh, that where it goes slowly okay. through an area. Yes. <laughs> now, is um, the is the roof area finished, or are you going to add more detail to it? Th th this is um, this is finished. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, um, I, I'm not. I, I like it. Like I like the simplicity because it's it's kind of like when you go messy and you go into something simplistic, that helps kind of like the room. It does sometimes. It does. And I think that that helped it. This is very cool, and I like the use of the oars in the walls here. Yeah, thank thank you. I was uh, just like wandering one day thinking what should I do with this area and I was like oh let's just add some random blocks there, there's a decided lack of blue ores though <laughs> well I'm not gonna say somebody got them <laughs> but I'm definitely not gonna say that I gave them away <laughs> definitely not <laughs> definitely not so um, and I've used the, the good old carpet uh, carpet trick to light up the area. Oh, good. 
I, I do hear some bad things behind the walls, though. Yeah, so I light up this area, Stina. <laughs> but not the, that, that, not the other. Not the other. Now, this is... <laughs> well, some of this area is lit up. <laughs> yeah, so... I definitely didn't want to light up the... Ow. <laughs> So I definitely didn't want to go light up that, uh, like this inner ring. Right. Very cool. Whoa. Thank you. We are we are stepping <laughs> into another world. <laughs> oh yeah. So this is a uh, one of my work in progress. Welcome to hell. One way entry. Uh huh. Wow. That is a really cool use of the uh, nether wart blocks. Thank you. There's a reason why this is on hold. Because of nether wart. Do, because of nether wart. Do you have a farm? Because of nether wart. <laughs> so, so anybody on the server, if you want to make Angel happy, he needs nether wart. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so this is all going by the design of um, of like the hellish, mm -hmm. and this is actually a working forge. So if you have like something you can actually burn, um, like a cobblestone or anything, no, um, no. sorry. Then um, apparently I oh, used it, up all it, my stone. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but as you can see, like this forge, if you come, chest. sorry, <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. There's little like a lot of areas we could just go dig. But uh, as, you, as you can see, I'm using um, kind of like the health forge design of using the, the red nether brick and the, okay. the regular nether brick. Mm -hmm. And then the, a lava where there's a hopper chain underneath that uh, puts all the items in here. I've been using it oh, to get some. Very cool. So you just throw it up into that area so, up there. Yep. And it feeds it and through the system and brings it out over here. Exactly. And it's uh, cool. it's slow, but it's it, it's kind of like an aesthetic thing. Like, you know it's there, so you can use it. I also like the use of Could... the anvils here. I think... Oh, yeah. <laughs> I've been working here too long, Stina. <laughs> <laughs> you you <laughs> kind of forgot you what's here. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. But, uh, but yeah, this this is afk a bowl. Not AFK of worth. Okay. Because uh, it works, but there's nothing collecting the items. Okay. That's very cool. So that's how far I have, uh, like, gotten. And this also gives, like, a good... Like, going up here on, like, a higher area, this gives a good, like, area view of how big the area actually is. It is a large area. So, I so, love how your work in progress looks so much better than... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> no, I can't see it. Than my whole base. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Stina. <laughs> and, and even myself, like, um, I also do YouTube, and I've been talking a little bit in one of my recent videos about me having to deal with the creative, like, you thinking that what you're doing is not good enough. Yeah. And when I see my, my base, I just see unfinished projects, which I would not consider good. Can, can you, like, see the pattern? Yes, I can. Okay. Yes, speaking so, of so Angel, me... speaking of Angel, look, his, his stuff is in the description below. So, uh, yeah, check out his, his videos because it's, um, they're pretty cool. There, got the plug in. <laughs> Thank you, Stina. I appreciate You're it. You're welcome. <laughs> oh. So, anything else to see? Don't jump in the lava when you when you go. Ooh, sorry, circle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can get a little bit lost, but yeah, don't jump in the lava. Don't jump in the lava. Okay, no lava jumping. Angel is no trying to keep me alive in the space tour. <laughs> Let's just say a few. People have died a lot. 
a lot. <laughs> yes, I don't come over here very often for that very reason. <laughs> She's just a little scared, guys. Just a little. I, 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 I like to preserve my life. <laughs> yeah. So, I think that was it for my little base tour. Wonderful. This is this is an amazing place, Angel. You really are doing a fantastic job and are a big inspiration Thanks. for for me in trying out some more organic builds and things like that. And my Um, <laughs> um No. Um, <laughs> I'll let you. I'll let you work magic on mycelium. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that's a whole other level. <laughs> that's a, another level. <laughs> All right. So. So yeah, there, there's not much. This is. All right. This is it. Wonderful. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to uh, leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to check out Angel's channel. He's been doing some really amazing things with his terraforming over uh, on this project as well as another big project that he's working on. So go check that out and um, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! Bye!